Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of Blasted Oasis. So, I am underneath my base here, trying to find friggin' nitrate powder, my god. Uh, so, I've kind of dug around where the iron was and where the lead was. And I found my way back to the coal, so now I'm trying to work my way between the lead and the coal. Hopefully, I stumble across something here. Like, I'd rather... Like, it's just all... It's cheesing me off, that's what it's doing. Like, if, if I was just playing this by myself and not recording, you know, it's not so bad, because it's like, I, I could just spend forever mining until I actually found nitrate powder. But I don't feel like doing that for this series. I don't feel like spending all of my time looking for bloody nitrate powder. But the worst part about it too is, is if this horde base is going to work, or we're going to amp up the difficulty, we need lots of um, pipe bombs. And in order to get lots of pipe bombs, I need lots of nitrate powder to be able to make gunpowder. So I got the coal now. I'm not worried about coal. I got so much of it, it's ridiculous. But without nitrate powder, we're in a lot of trouble. So. Uh, that being said, it may end up that we have to like hit up the hospitals, um, like where all the body bags are, any mortuaries that we find, just to try and find body bags, just to get as much nitrate powder to make as much gunpowder as we can. Because I, I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else to do. If I can't find um, nitrate powder down here over the next few days, I don't know, like I'm making my way around the lead now and it hooked excuse me it hooked up with the coal and that coal note is massive like the coal I have no problem finding so I'm gonna dig for like maybe like another in-game hour and then um, you know what we'll do is we'll go out and we'll do a pull off a mission today just to get my mind off this because this is crazy all right, well, I spent more than an in-game hour doing this because I really wanted to find nitrate powder, but I'm still at a loss here. I don't know. All right, let's get back upstairs. We've got a couple of jobs we can do, so uh, let's see if we can find my way out of here. Um, this way? There we go. Yeah, so I got a couple of jobs we can do. So we'll go to, we'll choose one, go do that, and then... Um, Hopefully I can forget about not finding the god darn nitrate powder. What I might do is, I need clay too, so I might actually go to the clay layer somewhere and just start digging a straight line and as soon as you come across sand at your feet, you know there's a, uh, a uh, ore node below you. So all you have to do is just, you know, start digging down to find it. So I might do that, I might just go along the clay layer at some point, but not right now. Our, we're getting full here with stuff. Got so much stuff. So let's get, uh, how much concrete do we have here? Let's organize this a bit. I uh, got 12, drop it in here. Get that going, we got some more in here now. Yeah. Um, okay, so you can go in there, you can go in there, you can go in there. I didn't get very much uh, coal, because I was trying to avoid it. We got over, like we got a bunch of stacks of coal. For this playthrough, it's plenty. We got 1,300. You know what? Let's make let's make a stack of 1,000 gunpowder. We don't have... How many points do we have to spend? So we got two points left. So, skill points. Demolition expert. When can we do... Oh, it's this next one up. So let's add... Wait, we got perception goggles, don't we? Uh, we got them in here. Um, shades, right? Yes. Okay. So let's wear these. And then we can spend a point. Where are you? Skills. We'll spend a point in this per perception. Then a point here. And now we can craft an efficient stack of gunpowder. Stack of 1,000, which only cost me 800, right? So that's 30. Uh, I'll just cram this in here. We get to 30. It's what? 24, 36? 36, yep. Alright, mix that. Get that started. We're definitely going to need it. Um, so that can go... Where are you here? You guys can go back in there. Wear this. Let's drop you back away. Let's Might as well just repair this now. 
And then what are we doing for food here? Let's just go ahead and use this. Got one rock busters left over. I think we just throw that in the bike. Just throw those in there for now. Uh, oh, we need to get the iron going here too. As much as we can. Um, so 42, 11, we need at least... I'll do that for now. It's going to run out, but whatever. Do we have any iron in there? No, we don't. And then we can take out of here. Let's just scrap this. Um, might as well just scrap these two. It's not a big deal. We've got so much lead, it doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, and then let's get out of here. We're going to go... I'm going to stock up on ammo, I think, before we go. Um, we do have a crap ton of it. I mean, we've got, like, what? 79 pipe bombs. So, I mean, we're okay for the next tour with, for, like, no problems at all. But after that, um, might be an issue. Probably not. But, all right, let's take a little extra of that. And then, I have a lot of 9 mil. A little extra of that. I think that'll be fine. All right. This away. Do we have any more coming? Yeah, a couple more seconds. Okay. Uh, we need anything else out of here? I don't think so. Nope. Okay. Once again, leaving without eating food, but whatever. I think I'll leave the rock busters here. All right. Okay. So we're fully reloaded. Fully reloaded. Okay. Now, what's the better of the two? We've got. The fetch clear at the waterworks. Let's go do waterworks. I know I can get that done today. So we'll do waterworks. Maybe we find a nitrate node over there. Oh, let's kill some more of these guys. I want to check my game stage too. We were at 134 a little while ago. But uh, I, I really, I'm, I really want to get to 150 if we can before next horde night. That's not starting off good. Starting off well, I guess I should be saying. Uh, now, what do we have in here? I think I want to take some stuff out of the bike so we can carry more back with us. Nah, I think we're okay. I could take the cab over there today, but we may have to go off-road, so I don't want to be doing that. Plus, we got a full tank of gas now, so... Yo, wait, what's up? All right, here we are. Let's just try to kick through this place real fast. Ooh, lock picks will take. Probably gonna need them. All right, ooh, truck. Any food? Uh, sure, I'll take the sewing kits. Anything over here? Ooh, car came back. 18 rounds, you know what we're gonna do before we go in? Take those. Let's go ahead and wrench these. Yeah, we got some zombies coming too. Zombie coming. What's up, buddy? Bye. Alright, take this guy out of here. That's it, eh? Not a lot out of that truck. Unfortunately, put whatever gas we did get in there. Not a whole lot. And we'll drop the rest of the shiz in here. I think later, uh, maybe today, maybe tomorrow, I want to start putting together a uh, um, a hoist so that we can uh, make some cars and stuff. Because I know you can make like a, a 4x4, like a dirt bike. A 4x dirt bike or whatever you want to call them. I don't know. It's got the same storage as a bicycle. In one of my offline playthroughs, I actually found one at a gas station. It's kind of cool, I gotta say. That's the play. That's the playthrough I'm going through where it's um, there's no traders. So like finding stuff like that is just like a godsend because you don't want to waste your your skill points on those things, right? Now right, we got a hammer on us. I don't know if that's premonit like premonition or foreboding here. Or what's going to happen? All right. Um, Pistol out. Let's see if we can just storm through this place. Okay, 
Yeah, he was Charl. Actually, you know what? We don't need this because we can make them, so we'll just get rid of that. I hear ya. Bring it all in for free hugs, guys. Free hugs. Looking for that stuff. That's what I'm looking for. We burned through a bunch of lockpicks, so I want to make sure we get them replaced here. I think we lost like six or so in the uh, hospital the other day. Or the bag over there. I'm not going to bother with the bag. Ah, doge. Is it just one? No, it's more than one. Should I go back? Ah, uh, I'm okay. That. That's a lot of dogs. They'll be through that door in a second here. Over here, guys. Come on. Loving the SMG, man. So in a situation like that, if you guys don't know, always go for the smaller group first. It does two things. One, it clears up one side, so you have, if you get your back side cleared, right? And then the second thing it does is it gives you a place to run, run away from. So you're not running through another group. Smallest group first. All right. Plus, of course, they're uh, capable of murdering you faster. Then don't go with those guys. I'm right here, dude. That's got to hurt. Let you break your way out. I'm going to quickly search some of this stuff. Actually, what was my game stage? We were I was talking about that a second ago. Got that kind of stuff. Uh, 138. So we've gone up four in, in the past few episodes. It's, it takes a little more later on. To go up in level. So it's gonna the game stage is gonna be uh, going up a little slower. We're gonna get some from killing zombies, but we get mostly most of it from levels and stuff. So. Actually, how many zombie kills do we have? I'd be interested in seeing that. 4,100, that's not bad. 4,100! Anybody in here? Anybody? Anybody? That goes... Okay, I know where that goes. Do a quick look in here. Nothing we want. Nothing we want. Yeah, sure. Ooh, repair kits, that's nice. What's up, buddy? So he's coming in from outside. I know there's dogs here. One down. Yeah, man, the zombies, like, it's so much better now with the, uh, the two-time zombie spawn. I can only imagine what the eight-time zombie spawn's like. Because there's, like, there's three versions of the zombie spawn mod. One is two times, one's four times, one is eight times. I, I just, could you imagine playing an eight-time zombies out here? That would just be, like, I couldn't imagine how awful that would be. Ah, we don't need either of those things. Let's go ahead and scrap this. I don't really even need the brass anymore either. Let's just use that. And yeah, might as well just use this too. I think we're going to be low on food again at the end of this. But I think if we hurry, we should be fine. Alright, so that's this side cleared. Down to the bowels of hell we go. Alright, so now they can't come in from behind me. Well, they can, but... That's bullshit. I love how sometimes you can... shoot through the bars and sometimes you can't. Whatever. 
Come on, lockpicks. Ah. Eh. Yeah, the, the design of some of these places is really good. Here's Feral. Alright, this is the area where they're all in the water. Come on, you guys. You should get to me faster. One down? Oh, we got a rad. Time for those headshots. Come on, buddy. I know you're down there. Here you come. No, you're not. Did we get him? We hit him, but we didn't kill him. Come on. There you go. Okay. Backpack. I'll take that. I can repair it and sell it. Can I get out of here now? I can if I know what I'm doing. All right. Through here. And then I think we can go like that. Feral. Ooh, got him on his way down. How you like them apples? Okay, nobody else there. I think this is a plug that gets you out. Yeah, there's a, a crate out here, but you got to dig your way through. I'm not going to do that. I don't even think it's a secret stash. I think it's just one of those random work crates. I, I you know, let's just use this. Just so we don't get infected while we're out here today. And of course, you can't get back, because why would we? Wow. Seriously? There we go. I think a steel pickaxe pick can't stove. Salt. Wow, well, you know what I'm talking about. I can't talk today. Recording too many episodes, that's what it is. Alright, wake up, you fuckers. I got a 44 solution here for you. Can I get that guy through these bars? Probably. That's somebody outside. No, it's not. There we go. Quickly check these bags. Ooh, black guy. We'll take that. Hey. Get back to work. Okay, I think there's one more in here. Or not? Oh, there you are. Sounds like those guys are inside now. Free gunpowder. Well, I'm take the take the one coin. Okay, now there's a way up here. That you can get in here. Come on. There you go. There's a weapons bag up here. Alright, some more parts. Parts is parts. Ah, fuck it. Take the plastic. Now, can I get... There's a way... to get into the next room. This way. This would be a cool, uh... starting base. I just got that. Yeah, those guys are up there. Yeah, you can drop down up here. Get you before you go too far. Are they through? No, they're still upstairs. They are still upstairs. Alright, we got some guys up in here. Hopefully I can stealth kill these guys. I don't want to have to, like, face them all. 
I know we got someone back there. There's always someone behind the boxes. We got two in there. Got a guy up here. Oh, it's a cop. Of course, of course it is. Get over here. I don't want you to blow up those. Blow up our loots. All right, and that's it. We got to get our supplies and we're out of here. Let's not forget those because that would be bad. Up in there. Now, I think, if I'm correct, the bag is under there. And I think there's a way in from here. Right? Should just be able to like. No, we gotta take this down. Is there no way to? No, I guess not. I was thinking. That, oops. I was thinking that you could be able to like, at least be able to jump and kind of sneak through that. It's one thing I like Darkness Falls for is you can actually sneak through the holes. And that's gonna be my next series. I'm gonna play Darkness Falls for my next series. That's that. Nothing else in here. Trash. Might as well take the oil since we're almost done. Um, let's make sure we reload you. Oh, come on. What is going on with my mouse today? I wonder where they're banging. Alright, I'm going to grab all the material here. Because it's free. Alright, that wasn't so bad. Let's get this stuff open. Find out what we got. A little bit of food and stuffs. Ah, junk turret. All right, let's get this open. Man, we used four lockpicks already. I do something I normally do. Whether this works or not, I don't know. We're gonna go down here. We're gonna hit a couple things. Right, hit a couple things. For some reason, more times than not, and I have, I can't explain why. But if you go off and do something else, and then you come back and you try and lockpick again, it usually goes through. Yeah. I don't know whether it's like an R it resets the RNG or what it, it does, but... Anyways, what do we got in this box? Some acid. Ooh, that's like, uh... The, what's it called, schematic parts? Um, okay, we don't need you and you. We'll take you. Don't need the paintbrush. That's the, uh... 4x4 four four accessories. I might build the truck and then not just just not use it. But then, I don't know, we'll see. Alright, what do we, we can put something else on here. Let's modify this. This is... Oh, impact bracing. We'll want that. And then, can the helmet take anything else? We can. Let's take uh, customized fittings. Better movement. Don't need this. We can go ahead and scrap it. We can scrap these guys. Uh, and yeah, let's get out of here. should only take a second to bang out of here. Come on. Why well, want a target right in front of me? That's where I'm pointing. Alright. Now, I think we just go back to the trader and go home and work on the base a little bit. I don't think there's a lot to do right now. We've got to keep that steel production coming. I want to do a little bit of upgrading with the steel we do have. That's really good. We'll do some upgrading with the steel that we do have. And then um, once that runs out, I might just go back down in the mine. I really got to find nitrate powder. But I might do that trick where I kind of go up to uh, um, clay level. Yeah, super rad. It's like four blocks down from the top, so it's like two blocks of broken stone, and then two blocks of um, clay, and then you're into stone underneath that. So if you go two blocks down and then go to the clay level, and just dig along, like up and down along the clay level, like in a straight line, as soon as you see sand at your feet, you know you're over top of a node, 
then you just dig, well not sand, gravel, but you dig down and then hopefully you can find something. I might, do, I might use that method because we do need clay for the forges. And I'll just go zo zipping along some in a, in a random direction. I don't know. What's up, buddy? Need assistance? Gratitude. I do need assistance. And we've already got that. We'll take this and sell it back to him. Um, let's sell you this. Sell you this. Sell you that. I'm not going to repair. I'm just going to sell this stuff. Sell that. Hang on to that. Got to check that out at home. We can sell you. I want to check this out at home too. Um, so that's not bad. Now you didn't restock. So you're good there. Let's take some. We'll buy the boiled meat off you. We got something in our belly here. Uh, any other food here? Just cornmeal and coffee, eh? I thank you guys. Uh, let's take boiled meat. Use that. A little bit of food back. I'm actually going to go ahead and take his coffees though. Because rather than going back home, we can just go ahead, let's eat this, eat this. We can just go ahead and pick a spot and start digging. Are you upset? He's totally upset that I ran him over. I mean, I don't, kind of don't blame you, but I didn't run you over. Why are you mad at me? Come on, over here. Now if I go this way, he'll go the other way. Well, he'll go down is what he'll do. Alright, where are we going to dig? That's the question. Still more? Oh, he's on the other side. Alright, let's drop some stuff in the bike here. Alright, now we got to decide where we're going to dig. Tell you what, let's just go like right here, I think. We'll go right here. Right on the corner. I kind of remember where this place is. Dig straight down and then two more. One, two. One, two. And we're going to go right along here. Two wood frames in there so they can't get to us right away. Uh, now, what do we have on us? We've got the rock busters, we've got the coffee. We're gonna save that if until we find, like when once we find a an ore node, but you can see here it's stone at the bottom. And if you can one-shot the the, uh, the clay, you can quickly move along and then hopefully find a node somewhere along here. Alright, well I spent a little bit of time here in game. I still haven't found anything. I made made it quite a ways along here though. Uh, about 10,000 clay. Let's have a look at the map. So, um, yeah, not even like, oh, we passed the, uh, we passed the Shamway building here already, and we're still going along the road. So, I mean, we made it a fair distance. Uh, you can see how, if, you, if you're able to one-shot clay, uh, it can kind of be worth it. It's, it quickly gives you clay, and you're also on the search for nodes underground. Because you're protected from above by two layers of uh, blocks, and the zombies don't quickly dig down on you anymore. Um, you should be w well protected even at nighttime if you're doing this. So even early game if you need clay, this can, this can work out. All right, but I'm gonna head back to the bike now and get home before it gets to be too dark. Screw it, we're digging our way out. I'm gonna run along the surface, it's faster. All right, let's get home. All right, so I think for tomorrow's episode, what I'll probably do, or the next episode, I don't think it's going to be, I think this is will be the Friday episode, so it might not be a tomorrow episode, depending. Excellent. Um, so I think for the next episode, what we'll end up doing is probably working on the house again. I want to get some stuff finished here, um, and we really need to like focus on getting uh, the horde base like ready to go. Um, let's go ahead and put this in here. We don't need all of it, but put that in there anyway. Where's our iron? 
So now this is uh, at least 2044, I think it needs to be all, all taken in somewhere around 44. Let's put 51 in just to be sure. Cool, get as much forged steel going as we can. It's going really slow, so I'm probably going to get a second forge running. Uh, I'll get this stuff put away um, in a minute. Let's just quickly go down. Actually, you know what? I'll do it off camera. I'm gonna go up. I'm gonna go upgrade the base a bit, um, and try and get at least the vital areas, like the the slits that we have. At least get those upgraded all to steel, because that's where the zombies are gonna be pounding on the most. Uh, so at least if there's two thick layers of steel there, if they break through one. I'll be able to at least know and defend against the, them breaking through the second one. But uh, I'll do that off camera and uh, yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. You can also drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.